Cam, a new three-year deal at Bristol City. How does that feel? Uh, yeah, very good. Um, it's been in the works for quite some time now, so uh, yeah, I'm glad to get it over the, the line and uh, time to kick on now for the season. Let's say that it's time to kick on, but is it is it reassuring to have your future secured for the next three years? Yeah, like you said, it's uh, it's, it's security really. Um, three-year deal, I couldn't really ask for much more. So uh, is it is shows good intent from the club and and yeah. Uh, time to push on and, and uh, hopefully prove them uh, prove them right. You joined Bristol City seven years ago. You've made 130 odd senior appearances, but you're one of the more senior players now, aren't you? Yeah, it's a bit crazy to think about it, really. Um, I wouldn't have ever thought that would be the case. Obviously, growing up and um, yeah, being out on loan all the time, I, I wouldn't have ever thought that I'd come back here and, and be one of the senior players, especially this early, because I'm only still 25. So. Um, yeah, it's a bit crazy to think about. A lot's been made of those seven loans, but you made your debut, uh, Reading away, August 2021. But do you really feel it was last season that you kind of made your breakout and solidified your place in the first team? Yeah, I think so. I think last season was um, kind of what I, I expect from myself uh, pushing forward. I think um, I still think I've still got a lot more to sort of give, but um, I think that's what I expect of myself. I want to I wanna be flying up the wing and um, uh, creating goals and... and, and and helping helping the team as much as possible. So yeah, um, that's what I expect of myself, and, and I feel like I've always got more to add to it. You mentioned it there, flying up the wind, scoring goals, creating goals. But you've played in a number of positions over the last last year. Really, you, you've played wing back, full back, left midfield, and even at centre back at times. But what do you feel is your best position? Um, I still think, obviously, left back is my best position. I feel um, defensively, I'm quite sound, and and I do I do like to get forward and, and join the attack. So yeah, I think left back. Um, but I'm I'm happy to play anywhere. I I, I enjoy playing centre back. I enjoy playing left wing back. Um, centre back. It is it's nice when I play there. It's nice that the gaffer trusts me to, uh, enough to actually fill in there and play there anyway. So um, yeah, is I'm happy to play anywhere. Do you think playing in those multitude positions, multiple systems? Do you think that's really rounded you as a player? <clears throat> I think so. I think um, like like I said, um, you you got to be more def defensively sound in, in sort of. In it, when you're playing centre half, and it, then when you're playing at left wing back, you're sort of playing as a winger sometimes. So it's, it's a completely different um, game when you think about it. So um, yeah, it's definitely uh, helped my game overall. Um, yeah, you played at centre back just with, with a co couple of injuries. Really, um, we've got a bit more depth now, a bit more competition for places. Is that something you relish having a bit of competition? I think so. Yeah. Um, I said the other day with Hayden, um, he, he's played unbelievably well every time he's come to the team. So it's something that I've got to look at and, and something that I've got to improve because, um, yeah, that that competition is massive. And, and if I want to be playing, I've got to be playing at my best. Otherwise, he's going to come in and, and, and do his best and then then I'm going to be out of the team. So, yeah. What has been your personal highlight over the old time at Bristol City so far? I've got to say my goal because um, it was a long time coming, I think. Uh, Six years it, it, it took to get that goal, so uh, obviously my debut was good, but um, it, it was a bit of a downer the way that, that game ended at Forest Green, so uh, yeah, it's, it's got to be my goal. Um, what are your goals personally over the next three years and as a team? Um, Premier League football, I think. Um, I think anyone sitting here doing this interview would say exactly the same. Um, with this club, um, I, th I think we've got the, the infrastructure and the facilities to, to be there. Um, we've just got to try and push on and, and, and make it happen. A good start to the season before Birmingham at home, really. But what does the team need to do to forget that and move on and really push on this season? I think we just got to stay consistent and stay patient with it. Um, a lot of teams now are sitting in rather than um, coming at us. So, so we've got to find a way to sort of break those sort of teams down. And uh, they, they, they make it difficult for us, but we've just got to stay patient on the ball and trust each other on the ball. And uh, yeah. And, and 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 yeah, we'll push on and, and and we'll get some results. Hull away tomorrow night. What kind of challenge is that? Uh, it's, it's a difficult challenge. They've uh, made some decent signings this year, so uh, yeah, it'll be an interesting game. Um, obviously, it's early on in the season, so you can't really tell um, what a team's sort of doing, what they're what they're what they're setting up like. Uh, but yeah, it'll be an interesting challenge as they've made some uh, pretty decent signings.